How's it going, everybody, guys? This is Mr. Reader here. Welcome back to another video. Today, I'll be showing you guys how to live stream videos on YouTube using OBS Studio and how to use OBS Studio. It's a very simple tool for gaming or art or entertainment. You can like stream stuff, do whatever you guys want. You can live stream to any service. You guys live stream on it. So easy. So, I'm going to show you guys how to live stream to YouTube. And uh, it's for Windows, Mac, and Linux. So if you guys want OBS Studios, link in description to download OBS Studios. And anyways, guys, let's begin. Let's start with how to download. So all you guys can do is download and start the setup. So you can see I already have it downloaded on my laptop. It's right here, OBS Studios already installed. So next, what you're going to have to do is launch it. So launch it, you're just going to have it saved on your desktop, wherever you have it saved. And you're going to, it's free too, guys. Okay, something else I want to let you guys know. If you guys do not know what OBS Studio is, it's a screen recorder and broadcaster software. And it's free. It's a completely free screen recorder. You can record as long as you want. No watermarks. It's so awesome. I would prefer this over Bandicam or iSpring or any other screen recorder just for the fact that how good this screen recorder is. So let's continue on how to use. So you're going to launch it. And uh, it'll take a minute to launch up. Just make sure you have it launched. And when you launch it up, it'll look like this. As you guys can see, you guys can see my face because I already have the thingy already started. I have the face cam up and running on OBS Studios. So it's first off, I'm going to show you guys how to uh, add face cam, how to start recording, do basic stuff. And then I'm going to show you guys settings, other stuff you guys can do. So first off, you're gonna re I'm going to remove all of this. Okay, I'm going to remove all of this and show you guys how to add and how to record using OBS Studios. So to start recording, what you guys are going to do is you'll see a black box in the center when you launch it up. And over here you'll say you'll see start streaming, start recording. I'll show you guys how to start streaming here in a second. You can studio mode, I don't know what that is, but I'm gonna show you guys stuff in the settings and how to set this up. Right here you can customize how loud you want the audio and your mic or whatever you guys have here. They have properties you can you know use your default device, use what device you guys want to uh, you know, use it for your mic and stuff like that. So first off, we're going to start with how to get, how to launch up the face cam. To launch up the face cam and how to start recording is you're going to right click on the black screen. And where you see add right here, you're going to go over here and you'll see all this stuff. Now the reason this is cool is because you can add stuff to your recording. That's something I like about it. So you can see right here we have audio input capture, audio output capture. Don't worry about any of these other than uh, video capture device and a few other these I'll show you guys. Video capture device, what this does is, this is face cam. You can enable your face cam, add existing face cam, I'm just going to create a new one and bam. As you guys can see, you guys can see my face right here and uh, you can pick what camera you're using and enable some of this stuff like, you know, you, you, you can capture the audio in the camera, do whatever you guys need to do, configure video, you can deactivate it, do whatever you guys want, I'm going to hit OK, you can adjust the size by the sides here, so you guys can see here, you can see the little circles here, you can adjust the size, I can make it extremely tiny, or make it cover the whole screen as you guys can see, hi guys, so you can see right here, it's pretty cool, uh, let's kind of just grab the edges here, now to start recording your screen, it's very simple, you're going to right click, and what you're going to do is you're going to add, okay, you're going to go back to add here. And what you're going to do is you're going to add uh, display capture and you're just going to hit OK. And what this does is this enables your screen that you want to start recording. So as you can see, hit OK. It kind of looks weird, you'll see this little majiggy thing. Now to enable your video capture over top of your display capture, what you guys are going to do is, I forgot, you have to do it after. Hold on, you guys have to do it after you add the thingy with Jake, so you're going to do that. And add here, as you guys can see here, and then video capture device. And you can obviously see my face here again. And I'm going to decrease the size here. And as you guys can see, I can start recording my screen. And to start recording, you hit start recording. But, here's the thing. When you hit start recording without editing anything in the settings, you just download it. It will not come up as an a video file. It'll only an MP4 file, whatever you guys use. It'll come up as a file you cannot open and watch your video on. Now I'm gonna go over that here in a second. So when you hit stop record, I mean start recording and stop it, it'll be saved your computer, but you're not gonna be able to watch it. And here's how you can fix that. 
right here you'll see a settings tab you're gonna click that button here settings okay and you'll open this now you can see this little tab here is the uh, settings tab so you can go under general here you can change the language you can change a the theme it should be on the default theme when you first get it but I like it under dark because you know it's cool and uh, you can uh, I'm not gonna show you any of this I just want to show you guys how to make it a video file to make it a video file you're gonna go to output recording and we go when it's under, under recording it'll be under FLV you do not want it under FLV you're gonna want it under mp4 I know it says warning don't worry about that or any of these other ones you can view your videos that's how to do that now what you're gonna do right here you could change where you want your file to go like I want my file to go under my screen recordings and select folder and as you can see right here it's under that folder here and then uh, oh, I dropped something it's okay uh, and then you can now okay so the whole purpose of this video is to show you guys how to live stream on this that's what we're gonna go to right here where he says stream it'll say stream key I can't show you my stream key you guys live stream on my YouTube channel and I don't want that say stream key I have my stream key and now to start live stream you're gonna go under your settings go under stream key I mean under stream okay you're gonna open up your YouTube channel on your laptop, computer, whatever you guys use, you're gonna open it up. Okay, I'm, I'm actually gonna disable this face cam real quick, actually, that I have on computer, guys. It's kind of slowing down my computer a little bit. Uh, oh, remove. Uh, yeah, to remove something, you just right click and hit remove. Okay, just hit yes here. Okay, cool. I hit settings here. Now, stream. Okay, so you're gonna go to your YouTube channel. Like my YouTube channel, as you guys know, mine's Mr. Reader, which you guys should know if you're a big fan of my channel here wait for it guys and go go to my channel go to your YouTube channel okay step one now what you guys are gonna do is you're gonna go to your video manager okay and you're gonna hit live streaming okay live streams you can see right here click that little button there and where it says live stream it says welcome back in your name here so now what you're gonna do is you're gonna go down and right here it'll say in quarter setup okay and then right here it'll say stream name slash key you're gonna hit reveal and you're going to copy this and paste it. I don't want to show you guys my stream key. I do not want you guys to see it. That's not good. So right here, you're just gonna copy this like so. Just copy. Okay, so you're gonna hit reveal and then copy. So you can see right here. Reveal, copy. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna paste it. Hit paste. And you're gonna paste that in there. And make sure you set it under YouTube as well right here. And, uh, and you make sure it's on primary YouTube server here. And then you just all you gotta do is hit apply here and then hit OK. And that's how you start live streaming. And then to live stream you hit start streaming. I don't want to live stream right now, but yeah guys, that's it for this video. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please give a thumbs up and I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace guys. See ya. Bye bye.